Mitsubishi is bringing in the upgraded refresh expander that has been first rolled out in Indonesia. Mitsubishi says two variants or trim levels of the refresh expander will soon be offered in the local market, the GLS and the GLX. The refresh expander should be a welcome addition to the local MPV segment and perhaps those looking to have a comfortable 7-seater MPV as a family vehicle should wait a while before making a purchase. Head-to-head -head offers a spec-to-spec -spec comparo between the Mitsubishi Expander GLS AT and the GN6GE from GAC Motors, one of the Chinese brands now gaining more and more acceptance in the local market. The GN6 is among the longer and wider entries in the midsize MPV market that's 4,780mm long, 1,860mm wide, and 1,730mm tall, with a 2,810mm long wheelbase. The Refresh Expander is expected to arrive soon, is listed at 4,595mm, 1,750mm wide, and 1,750mm tall, with a 2,775mm long wheelbase and 225mm ground clearance. The GAC GN6 has been getting admiring second looks on local roads with its stylish grille, the eagle eye headlamp design with wing light DRLs, the integrated bumper with uniquely framed fog lamps, side view mirrors with integrated turn signal indicators, and a sunroof. The Refresh Expander GLS arrives with chromatic dynamic shield grille, color keyed front and rear bumpers with painted garnish, chrome belt line molding, silver painted side sill garnish, power folding chrome side view mirrors with integrated turn light, LED type headlamps and front fog lamps with silver painted bezel and 17 inch wheels. The Expander also comes standard with a rear window defogger, LED type tail lamps, lift type tailgate, rear spoiler with high mount stop lamp, front and rear towing hooks and shark fin antenna. Being wider and longer than most others in the mid-size MPV segment translates to the GN6 having among the roomiest of interiors. Inside one finds a dashboard that looks modern and elegant with its 7-inch instrumentation and 8-inch infotainment displays housed in a single panel. The GN6 features leather seats for 7 in a 223 configuration with two captain's chairs in the second row, and bench seat for 3 with matching headdress in the third row. The captain's seat slides and reclines in the 7.5-inch space between them allows for easy passage to the third row seat which can be folded flat to increase luggage space from 3 to 24 liter to 1,000 liters. Comfort and convenience features in the GNC include keyless entry, push and start, adjustable steering wheel with controls for the audio and cruise control, automatic climate system with vents for rear passengers, electronic parking brake, power outlets, cup and beverage holders, and USB ports. A center console also features cockpit controls. A refreshed interior of the new expander now features Mitsubishi's horizontal axis design identity as well as soft padding accents and door trims. A colored multi-information display monitor, a white light high contrast instrument plus or highlights the new expander GLS dashboard. Arranged in a 232 configuration, the expander seats are upholstered in rich fabric, with those in front able to slide and recline with the driver getting a dial type height adjuster. The second row seat for three split 60-40, slides, reclines, folds, and tumbles. The third row seat splits 50-50 and can be reclined as well as fold fully flat. The GLS comes with leather wrap, gear shift knob, and steering wheel that tilts, telescope, and features controls for the audio system and cruise control. Comfort and convenience features in the new Expander GLS include keyless entry and engine push start system, air conditioning with heater and digital controls, power windows and door locks, and electronic parking brake. Also standard are three 12-volt accessory outlets, six cup holders, bottle holders on the front doors, rear cargo storage box, and convenience hook on driver's seat. The GN6 infotainment system features 8-inch touchscreen, Bluetooth connectivity, Apple CarPlay, and a six-speaker system. The new expanded GLS infotainment system features a 7-inch smartphone-like display, audio touchscreen with Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto, Bluetooth, radio tuner, a USB, and six speakers. The GN6 is powered by a 1.5-liter turbocharged inline 4 gasoline engine that generates 170 horsepower and 265 Nm of torque, sent to the front wheels by a 6-speed automatic transmission. GAC equipped the GN6 with front L-type McPherson struts and rear twist beam. The brake system uses front ventilated and rear solid disc. The Refresh Expander GLS is powered by a 1,499cc engine, 4-cylinder 16-valve MIVEC gasoline engine that generates 103 horsepower and 141 Nm of torque and comes with a 4-speed automatic transmission that drives the front wheels. The new Expander suspension uses front McPherson struts with full spring and stabilizing rear torsion beams. The brakes provide the same confident and predictable stopping power, using ventilated front discs and leading and trailing jumps in the rear. 
GN6 comes with a host of standard and safety and some of the more advanced driver assist technologies from anti-lock brakes with electronic brake force distribution to electronic stability program, traction control, hill ascent and descent controls. It also comes in rear sensors and camera as well as three-point seat belts, dual front and side airbags, isofix child seat anchors, engine immobilizer and anti-theft alarm. The new Expander GLS also arrives equipped with safety and driver assist tech and features that include anti-lock braking system with electronic brake force distribution, brake assist, active stability control, traction control, and hill start assist. It also comes with reverse camera, front SRS airbags, 3-point ELR seat belts for 7 with pre-tensioners in the front row, tile-proof locks, teether anchors, side impact beams, and laminated green glass. <laughs>